What a battle it was Saturday night when the Troy women's basketball team came back in the final 15 minutes to pull out a 77-73 win over South Alabama, pushing the Trojans' record to 23-4 and 14-2 in the conference. My assistant coaches were fantastic. They stayed out in the hall. They came up with really an adjustment to our defense that we really haven't done before and practiced before. And they stepped out on faith as well and, and figured out a way to break it down to the team where they could understand it and went in there and made an adjustment at halftime. I was doing my thing, which is just rah rah with cheerleaders, being a cheerleader and, and pumping them up. And they were doing some tactical things coming in. And um, my assistant coaches were fantastic and, and they did make some adjustments at halftime that helped us win the game. With Japonica James leading Troy offensively with 24 points, Kayla Robinson also came in clutch in some tough times for the Trojans. The Trojans trailed the Jags most of the game while South was shooting at 70% from the three going into halftime with a nine point advantage. It's a mode that Michaela goes into that is like refuse, refuse to lose and Pawnee does too. Pawnee seems to do it more on defense with steals and kind of intimidating and being up on defense. Michaela does it more with the pull up jumper and driving and pull up jumper and drawing fouls. Troy came back into the second half with a different type of hunger. They held South just at a 28% shooting from the field. Troy applied more pressure defensively and outscored South 17-5 going into the fourth quarter. After trading basket for basket in the fourth quarter, Troy took the largest lead at 77-73 to to end the game. I really can't remember a time being more proud of a team um, when their back was really against the wall and there was no way we could see a way to win. We could never gain any ground in the game. The team really went off faith and believed that we could do it. And they refused to lose and they chipped away one possession at a time. And that's how you claw back in things. And I think that's an example of the true Trojan spirit. When your back's against the wall and you're the underdog, that's when you're your best. And that's what it was today. This win does put Troy in the top seed for the Sun Belt Tournament. But first, the Trojans will close out their regular season this week in Arkansas. In Mobile, Jessica Phillips, Troy, Trojan Vision Sports.